Hello, hello. Hello, hello, my dear class, how are you? Hello. Hi, everybody. Welcome. Bienvenidos sean todos a este nuevo día. Buenas noches. Good Hello. Good, night. good evening. Good evening. Ah, good evening. <laughs> good evening. Cuando entramos a una reunión, cuando llegamos a un lugar y es temprano en la noche todavía, pero vamos llegando, decimos good evening. Cuando ya nos retiramos, porque nos vamos a ir a casa o ya no nos vamos a ver, decimos good night. Por eso cuando acabo la clase les digo, ok, have a good night, because I am not going to see you anymore. Cuando entramos, decimos good evening. Ok, practice with me. Okay. Good evening. 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 Evening. Good, evening. Good, evening. Good evening. Good evening. Okay. Good evening. After good evening. lunch, después de almuerzo decimos good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Some people say good afternoon and it's good correct. Afternoon. Okay. Good afternoon. Good morning in the early morning, right? Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good evening. Good night. Good night. Okay, there you have for the different moments of the day. For the different times of the day. So please, I, okay, all the cameras are on. Very good. I cannot see Madeline. And let's see. I can see Rosie now. Very good. Mr. Moises. Very nice. And Jonathan, right? Welcome, my dear students. It's a pleasure to see you again. How was your day? Was it good, so-so, or bad? How was your day? ¿Cómo estuvo su día? Good, so-so, or bad? Good. 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 So, good. thumbs up. Entonces, so, con, de, so. con deditos arriba. Good. So, good. 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 Bad. So, I think all days are good. De todo aprendemos en cada día. Great. So, yesterday, I asked you to work in the platform, and I saw some of you doing it today. Ya vi algunos que ya están trabajando en la plataforma, y ya van preguntando ahí por los ejercicios, ya van avanzando. Okay. ¿Tuvieron el chance de trabajar en la plataforma este día? Sí. Yes. Yes, yes very good. Yes, I do it. Yes, yes, I did, you say, because it's in past. Okay, eso ya lo vamos a ver más adelante. Yes, I did, you see. Okay, so today we are going to start our day remembering a little bit of our agreements, right? Remember the agreements that we have in class. There you go. The first agreement that we have, what is it? Lo leemos entre todos. What is the first one? Practice, Practice, your, Practice your English as, as possible. 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 Practice your English as much as possible. Ask Number for two. Help when needed. Ask for help when needed. Keep your for cameras of during all Keep the your cameras class. during all the class. Keep your cameras on during Keep all the class. During all the class. The Attend next one. all your sessions. Attend all your time. sessions on time. Attend all your sessions on time. Very good. What about the next one? Participate, participate as, as much, much as possible. Participate. 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 No, Ray, say participate as much as possible. Participate. Participate as much as possible. Keep a cooperative attitude. During class. During class. During class. Okay. How do you pronounce it? Okay. Attitude. Attitude. Okay, you say keep a cooperative 
attitude. During class. Collaborate with your friends on the WhatsApp group. What's up? What's up? What's up? Do you know what's up? It's like, ¿qué ondas? ¿Qué pasa? What's up? Right? That's why it's called what's up. Por eso es el grupo de what's up, porque ahí se cuentan todos que, ¿qué onda? Vea qué está pasando. Si decimos, hey, what's up? Así como, hey, ¿qué pasa? Vea. Por eso se llama what's up, the group. So you say, the what's up. Por eso se llama así la aplicación. La aplicación es, ¿qué onda? ¿Qué pasa? <ríe> si fuera salvadoreña. Te mandé un mensaje en el, ¿qué onda? <ríe> so there you go. That's the WhatsApp thing. So remember, you say cooperative. Cooperative. Attitude. Cooperative. Attend. 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 English. 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 During. English. During. Sessions. 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 Friends. Friends. Okay. Please, from now on, desde este punto en adelante. Me siento halagado. Tómale una foto a las palabras. Toma una foto de las palabras. Thank you. <laughs> so you say friends. 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 De aquí, friends. de este punto friends. de nuestra vida en adelante, nunca vamos a volver a decir friends. Ok. Friends. Marcamos friends. un antes y un después. So you say friends. 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 De, de aquí friends. en adelante no vamos a decir whatsapp. You say whatsapp. What's 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 Open the whatsapp what's up up group. group. Right? Open What's the up? WhatsApp the group. Open. Okay. Open. Good. De aquí en adelante nunca vamos a decir te mandé un WhatsApp. No. What's up? Un WhatsApp. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? No, say what's 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 up? Up. What's up? Very good. Very nice. Okay, my dear students, these are some of the words that we learned yesterday. This is some of the vocabulary that we learned in the previous class. What we are going to do with this vocabulary is to create sentences. We are going to create sentences with the different words. Here we have different words presented. For example, here we have she, he, his, they, we, my, your, her, first name, last name, and we have favorite, okay? What we are going to do is to create sentences with the different words that we have here, okay? I need you to create at least five sentences. Tienen que crear al menos cinco oraciones con las diferentes palabras que les he mostrado. Ayer hicimos muchas oraciones utilizándolas, but we are going to work on this today, okay? The only difference that we are going to do it in little groups. Lo vamos a hacer en grupitos de tres, así que vamos a ir a crear oraciones. Tenemos que crear al menos cinco, okay? So we are going to make the groups right now. Les va a llegar una invitación en su pantalla y va a decir unirse a la sala de grupos pequeños. Y le dan a aceptar. ¿Ok? Go ahead. Ok. There you go. There you go. Ahí le va a llegar la invitación. There you go. Go to the different rooms. Go to the different groups and create the sentences. Okay. Okay, so right now, all of them are in the groups. Hello, Oscar, how are you? How are you? 
fine. Los acabo de enviar a los grupos. Lo voy a agregar a uno de los grupos para que pueda trabajar con ellos. Ok, lo que estamos haciendo okay. son oraciones. Oraciones con las palabras que están ahí presentadas. Ahí se las envié en el grupo para que todos las puedan tener. Ok. Ok. I am going to send you to one room. And I'm going to send you to room one. Ok. There you go. Ok. Ok. Ahí le va a llegar la invitación para que se una al grupo. There you go. Excellent. So as all my students are in the different in the different rooms, they are going to create short sentences with the words presented. We are going to go and see how they are doing. Let's go to the different groups. Okay, I'm going to Yo creo que debe entrar porque ahí veo que está la... Sí, ahorita. Ajá, ahí está. Ajá. No, ya estábamos viendo cómo hacíamos con lo de... Eh, similar a lo de ayer. Ah, ok. Les envié la imagen al chat de WhatsApp ah. para que ustedes ahí puedan agarrar las palabras que vamos a utilizar en las oraciones. Ah, ok. Okay, it's very similar to what we did yesterday. Es muy similar a lo que hicimos el día de ayer. Así que para que ustedes puedan crear sus oraciones ya de manera original, diferente, ¿ok? So, work on that. Voy a ir a ver qué están haciendo los otros chicos, a ver si no están allá platicando. Vaya, perfecto. <laughs> work, please. Uh -huh. Uy, <laughs> hello. <laughs> Hello. Solo asustar a Sofía entre. <laughs> <laughs> okay, how are you doing? No problem with the sentences? No problem. Problemas, dificultades con las oraciones. Se las envía al chat para que las puedan hacer. Ah, es que no es una... ah, ya ven, vea. Ahí se los envié. Siempre pensando en ustedes. Ahí envié la imagen al chat para que tengan las palabras que tienen que ocupar. Uh -huh. Ok. Pero al chat de aquí de, de la aplicación. No, no, no. En el WhatsApp. 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 Yes. WhatsApp. Es que no estoy WhatsApp. incluida. Por eso no eh, ando perdida. Eh, Madeline. En el Pero le llegó el correo con todas las indicaciones del el link de conexión y todo. Sí. Va, es en, que ese, el, el... Ajá. Ajá. en ese correo va el link para unirse al grupo de WhatsApp. Mm. Si quieren continuar para mientras yo lo, 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 que entre... teníamos que hacer oraciones así como por ejemplo aquí usted nos ha dejado varias opciones verdad por ejemplo Ajá. cheese smart ale ella es alta o uh, she's cheese, tall por el bello cosas así verdad yes exactly okay. like that bueno. okay so finish your sentences I am going to see what the other ones are doing voy a ver qué están haciendo los demás ya vuelvo Okay. His, his, his name is Juan. Juan. Good sentence. Good sentence. <laughs> continue working. Continue working. I am just checking. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, teacher. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Did you finish? Son cinco, ¿verdad? Por el grupo. Five was minimum. Five. If you want to make oh. more, that's, that's okay. Si quieren hacer las once, it's okay. <laughs> Paola, I can... Si hay tiempo your... todavía. Yes, we have like two minutes yet. Okay, finish. I am going to go and check the other groups. Pues creo que ya, ¿verdad? What is your last name? Good sentence. What, what is your last name? Very good sentence. Which ¿Sí? sería, what her last... sería una pregunta, una question. It's okay, but it's a sentence. It's okay. Sí, es como una pregunta. Está, está bien. Yes. Sí, porque lleva el WH. Yes, exactly mm -hmm. like that. Well, did you finish? What, so, um, did you finish? It was 
five, the minimum. If you uh -huh. have more than five, that's okay. Ah, okay. ¿Cuántas lleva? Yo cuatro. Eh, ¿En the group? Sí, cuatro. Sí, bueno, oh. lo hemos dicho, ¿verdad? <laughs> okay. Sí. Okay, create one more. Le voy a dar un minuto más en todo lo que regresamos. Okay. Go ahead. Eh, quiero ver. Welcome back. Ah, all of them yes. are, are coming back. That's very nice. Okay, my dear students, I am going to ask for different examples, okay? I am going to ask for different examples. Group number two is still coming back. Por ahí vienen de vuelta todavía el grupo dos, el grupo cuatro y el grupo seis. Todavía están allá terminando. So, for group number one, I have Janet, Jonathan, Rosy de Rodríguez and Rosy Lopez. For group number two, let me see. I have Jose Wilfredo, Madeline, Nancy, and Sofia. Group three, Claribel, Maria, Mary, and Moises. Group number four, Laura, Maria, and Victor. Group number five, Ronald, Ruth, Jancy, and Zulma. Group six, Stephanie, Jose, Paola, and Yesenia. And group seven, Juan, Carla, Oscar, and Regina. So group number one. Janet, Jonathan, no. Rosy, who is going to give me examples? Deme ejemplos. Group number one. Uh, uh, he is my brother. Uh -huh. His name is Pablo. Very good. Group number uh, one, another example. ¿Quién más del grupo uno me puede dar ejemplos? Jonathan, Rosy, Janet. Estaba hablando, pero lo tenía en silencio. <laughs> ok, the secret of life. Go ahead. Uh, eh, she is my mother. His name is Veronica. Her name. Her name, uh, right? Because you say I she. Her, her, her name. name. Her, her name. name. What about the next one? Another example. Group He's no. Uh -huh. Rosy. Rosy, go ahead, go ahead. She is my mother. She, she, she is, is my, my mother. mother. Very good. Group mother. number two. Jose, Madeline, Nancy, and Sofia. He is my father. We are English students. Very good. My food favorite is chicken. My favorite food. My favorite food is chicken. Very good job. Group number three, Claribel, Maria, Mary, and Moises. Uh, she is my sister. Her name is Genesis. Uh -huh. He is my father is John. Okay, he is my father. His name is? John. John. Okay, very good. John. Let me see. Number four, Laura, Maria, and Victor. She is my daughter. Uh huh. She daughter, is, my daughter. My, she is my friend. Okay. We are English students. Very good job. Just remember the pronunciation. Daughter. 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 Good. Daughter. Group number five. <laughs> Ronald, Ruth, Jansi, and Zulma. He is Ronald Diaz. He is my classmate. Very good. We are a student. We are students. She is beautiful. She is beautiful. Oh, thank you very much. <laughs> Number six, Stephanie, Jose, Paola, and Yesenia. And my favorite person is my son. Good. Another example. Group number six, another example. 
His car is red. Very good. His car is red. Very good, Paola. And for group number seven, Juan, Carla, Oscar, and Regina. Examples? My cell phone is expensive. Good. She's a, she's a nurse. Uh -huh. Her name is Rosie. Very good job. Very good job on the sentences. Excellent students. Yay. Very nice review. Muy buena manera de hacer el review de la clase del día de ayer. Very good job. Okay. Uh, I am going to call the attendance. Le puede pasar la asistencia para que, este, ya que ya estamos ya la mayoría, para poder dejar la constancia de este día. Vamos, recuerden que pueden decir here or present, ok? But it's, make sure that you report, ok? Stephanie Guadalupe Galdames. Present. Janet Rosibel Rivas. Present, teacher. Jonathan Fernando. Present. José Daniel Valdizón. Ok, José Daniel. No he visto a José Daniel ahora. The next one, let's continue. Let's me, let me continue. José Eduardo Mengíbar. Present teacher. José Wilfredo Coreas. Present. Juan Pablo Guzmán. Present. Thank you. Carla Sofía Ramírez. Ok. Carlita Sofía. Present. Thank you, thank you. The next one. Let's continue, let's continue. Eh, Laura Lisette Díaz. Present. Thank you. Madeline Rocío. Thank you. María del Carmen. Go María del Carmen Gómez. Present. María Elena Flores. Present. Mary Guadalupe López. Present. Moisés Antonio Segueda. Present. Nancy Jocelyn Sánchez. Present. Oscar Antonio Ramos. Present. Thank you very much. Uh, Osmilda Claribel. Present. Thank you. Paola Lucia. Present. Thank you. Regina Guadalupe. Present, Miss. Okay. Ricardo Alexander Flores. Mr. Ricardo Alexander. Se nos perdió Ricardo, hoy no vino. Ronald Ernesto Díaz. Ronald Ernesto Díaz. Thank you, Ronald. Rosa María Miguel. Present. Thank you. Rosy Natalie. Thank you. Ruth Daniela. Ruth Daniela Molina. Present, teacher. Thank you. Present. Sofía Geraldine Rivera. Present. Thank you. Víctor Alfredo Canizales. Present. Xiomara Elizabeth Hernández. Xiomara. <laughs> Jansi Yamilet Amaya. Anaya, sorry. Yancy Amilet. Thank you. Yesenia Beatriz Galán. Yesenia. Ok, and Zulma Mercedes. Present. Thank you very much. Si se me quedó alguien, me confirma, please. O alguien que entró después que ya había pasado su nombre, me avisa igual. 
José Daniel. Ah, José Daniel Valdizón. Hello, welcome. Ya le había puesto ahí que no había venido, pero ya vino. <laughs> There you go. Welcome, José Daniel. Thank you. Okay, let's continue working. Siempre recuerden, chicos, si de repente eh, algún día entran justo después del minuto 25, que ya he pasado la lista, eh, siempre repórtenme en el chat. Miss, ya vine, aquí estoy, vea. Porque casi siempre en el minuto 25 es que yo paso la lista. Ok, I wanted to show you something here. Can you see my screen? ¿Pueden ver mi pantalla? Yes. Ok. Yes. Yes. This is yes. called survival language. Eso se llama vocabulario de sobrevivencia. Here, these are sentences that you can use for you not to use Spanish in class. Ok. These are sentences that you can use to communicate in English. And for sure, so you avoid saying like, Teacher, ¿y cómo dice eso? ¿Y cómo, cómo es en inglés? Teacher, me repite. No. For you to get the habit of practicing your English. You say the first one. Teacher, how do you say? Teacher, how do you say tamales in English? Tamales, right? It's the same. It doesn't change. In Chinese, it's tamali. Maybe. But in English, it's tamales. It's the same. Teacher, how do you say jocotes in English? Uh -huh. Who knows? ¿Quién me ayuda? ¿Quién sabe cómo se dice jocotes in English? How do you say jocotes in English? And don't say jocote. No. <laughs> Because it has a name. How do you say jocotes in English? How do you say no? No, ah. I, mean. <laughs> I don't know. I don't, I don't know, right? No sé. They, they are called mom beings. Ahí se los envío en el chat. Mom beings. You see, it's new, it's new. How do you say zapatos in English? Shoes. Aha. How do you say cielo falso in English? And don't tell me false sky, okay? No. <laughs> How do you say cielo falso in English? I don't know. Aha. I don't know. It's Ceiling. 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 Ceiling, right? Ceiling. 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 How do you say equipaje in English? Bags. No, bags son maletas, son bolsas. Bags. How do you say equipaje in English? Baggage, Some, mm. something like that. Baggage, it's good, but there is another word that it's more common. How do you say? Aha, very good. Teacher, how do you say? Because I don't know. It's luggage. Luggage. Oh. Luggage. It's on the oh, chat luggage. as well. How do you say? How do you say? Let me see. Sandia in English. Um, watermelon. Watermelon, watermelon, right? Watermelon. 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 How do you say? Uh, Zorro in English. Fox. 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 How do you say amarillo in English? Fox. Yellow. Yellow. Ah, yeah. <laughs> Easy ones. Easy ones. How do you say, uh, let me see, teclado in English? Keyboard. Keyboard. Keyboard, right? Keyboard. Keyboard. How do you say, um, how do you say salsa negra in English? Black salsa. Ah. Ah. <laughs> no, it has a name. It has a specific name. The word Worcestershire, I don't know what. <laughs> Se llama Worcester sauce. <laughs> Something like that. Se lo voy a enviar al, al, al chat. Ahí tengo un video. <laughs> De cómo se dice salsa negra en inglés. Salsa inglesa. <laughs> it's, it's a very curious thing. So, how do you say espejo in English? Mirror. 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 Mirror, right? Mirror. 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 Excellent. So that's the Mirror. way you use the language. How do you say? En, oh. Y ayer no andamos por el mundo diciendo, ¿y cómo dice tal cosa? Right. You say, how do you say? And you use the word in English. How do you spell? ¿Cómo lo deletrea? How do you spell? 
How do you spell English, people? E-N-G-L-I-S-H. Letter by letter. English. What is the meaning? Teacher, what is the meaning of luggage? What is the meaning of luggage? Equipaje, you say. Teacher, what is the meaning of yellow? Amarillo, right? Teacher, what is the meaning of lizard? What is the meaning of lizard, people? Lizard. Uh huh. Thing. What is the meaning of lizard? Es un animal. Uh huh. Lizard. I don't know what is lizard. <laughs> lizard. Similar to the iguana. What is lizard? Chameleon. No, chameleon, chameleon is chameleon. Chameleon. <laughs> 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 lizard. Iguana. Well, iguana, it's, uh, it's a big one, right? But lizard, lizard, it's called lagartija. 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 <laughs> lizard. Thank you, Richie. Thank you. <laughs> but I like the English, the English sound. Say, thank you, <laughs> That was good. That was good. Lizard, it's lagartija. Can you repeat that, please? Teachers, can you repeat that, please? It's like, ¿pueden Teacher, repetir eso? Can you, can you repeat that, please? Very good. Uh, yes. Sí, sí. De repente nos pasamos, yo expliqué alguna cosa y no entendió, no escuchó. Teacher, can you repeat that, please? Teacher, I need help. Necesito ayuda. I need help. Oh. Teacher, oh. I don't understand. No entendí. Teacher, I don't understand. Teacher, can I stand up? O sea, tengo que ir a hacer algo. Me tengo que levantar. Can I stand up? Okay. Can I stand up? In the, in the class, for sure, you are not going to go to the restroom. Unless it's an emergency, right? If it is an emergency, yes, you can go. But try to go to the restroom before, right? Traten de ir al baño antes. No, I say, teacher, can I go to the restroom? No, right? <laughs> like in the presential classes. Teacher, how do you pronounce? How do you pronounce? ¿Cómo lo pronuncia? How do you pronounce? Teacher, can I answer the phone? Maybe you have an emergency. You have a phone call and you need to go. Teacher, can I answer the phone? Teacher, can you explain again? Teacher, can you explain again? Okay. Practice the vocabulary with me. Teacher, how do you say botella in English? Todos, todos, todos. Bottle. Practiquemos el vocabulario. Teacher, how do you say botella in English? How do you spell bottle? How do you spell bottle? How do you spell? How do you spell bottle? Teacher, what is the meaning of that? Teacher, what is the meaning of that? Teacher, teacher, what is the meaning of that? Can you repeat that, please? Can you repeat that, please? Okay, importante. Lo único que no podemos decir es, can you, re can you repeat again? Ahí yeah. eso sería equivocado. ¿verdad? Can you repeat again? Like, ¿Puedes repetir, repetir? <laughs> ¿Puedes repetir de nuevo, de nuevo? Right? Can you repeat that, that please? please? Teacher, I need help. I need help. Teacher, I don't understand. I don't understand. Teacher, can I stand up? Can I stand up? up? Teacher, how do you pronounce? How do you pronounce? Can I pronounce? Teacher, can I answer the phone? Teacher, can you explain again? 
Teacher, can you explain the game? Very good job. Okay, so, yes? Yes, teacher. Yes? What is the game? De nuevo. Explain. Explicar. Explicar. Can you explain again? Can you explain de nuevo? For sure, right? I can explain all the times that is necessary. Please. Is meaning. Uh -huh. is meaning. Meaning. Significado. What is the meaning? What is the meaning? ¿Cuál es el significado? Teacher, uh, how do you say Teacher, what? I can you repeat that, please? Uh, can I the telephone? Uh, mm. Ah, can I answer? <laughs> Answer. 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 Can I answer the phone? It's like beep. Hi, how are you? Answer. Can I answer? Beep. Hi, yes. Can I answer the phone? It is funny when you say like, what is the meaning of meaning? Significado. <laughs> what is the meaning of meaning? Aquí esta palabra. Meaning. What's the meaning? What's the meaning, meaning of meaning? Significado. Uh -huh. Significado. Meaning significa significado. <laughs> okay. So it is important, and this is going to be useful from here until the advanced levels, right? Eso, la, al menos lo, la bondad que tiene, que este survival language lo van a ocupar de aquí uh, en adelante. Ok. So, oh, yeah, for sure, for sure, because you don't, you don't know. It's like, oh, can you help me? What is the meaning of this? Can you explain? So for you to communicate and we don't use Spanish anymore. Ahora ya no me pueden andar preguntando, ¿y cómo se da la trata, teacher? ¿Y cómo se dice? ¿Y qué significa? You say, what is the meaning? How do you say, right? Use the vocabulary, use the vocabulary. How do you pronounce? Teacher, can you repeat? Okay, use the vocabulary. Good. Okay, just to finish the topic about the names, here we have a little bit of the titles. Los titles son los títulos que le ponemos a veces al nombre antes para marcar si es señora, señorita, señor, right? So here we have, for the ladies, we have three. We have Miss, Mrs, and we have Miss, right? This one, the first one, Miss, is when you are not married, right? No está casada, Miss. Uh, in this case, I can say Miss Laura. Laura, are you married? No, right. Laura, estás casada? Laura Díaz? No, so in that case is Miss Diaz, right? But let's see, I have Maria Elena. ¿Estás casada? Maria Elena Flores? Creo que se me ha quedado congelada. Let's see, eh, Claribel. Ah, ahí está, ya, ya, ya volví. Ahí estamos. María Elena, ¿estás casada, sí o no? No, it's Miss. Miss Flores. Let's see. ¿Claribel? Yes. Ok, so you say Mrs. Monterrosa, because she's Miss. married, right? Mrs. Right, this Miss. one. Mrs. Monterrosa. This one, this Mrs., it's when you don't know if the lady is married or not. Si no sabes si está casada o no está casada, Vámonos a lo seguro. Ocupe, Mrs. <laughs> Mrs. You don't know. In the written form, okay? En la forma escrita lo ponemos así. The M and the letter S. Mrs. For the boys, there is no complication, right? Mister. For married or single. Ahí con los chicos es mucho más fácil. Solo dice Mr. Mr. Coreas, right? Mr. Mengíbar. Mr. Yes, el apellido. Yes, it is the most common one. It's with the last name. Okay. Siempre decimos, por ejemplo, Mr. Canizales, right? There are some people who say like Mr. Victor, and it's okay. But the most common is with the last name. Mr. Osegueda. 
for example. Right? So you use it like that. Con los chicos bien chévere porque no se sabe si está casado o no. Mister. Para las chicas, miss, misses, que no se quede, que no se cuente. Right? Check if she has a ring. And if she doesn't have a ring, single. <laughs> so, and also Mr. Donut, right? <laughs> I remember, <laughs> Mr. Donut. Mr. Donut. Mr. No nos están pagando nada por este comercial. Mr. Donut. Ok, el señor de las donas. Mr. Donut. And the two final examples that I have here, that it's called sir and madam, yeah. it's for you to refer to a person. Cuando te refieres a una persona. Here in our country, in El Salvador, it is very common that they are like, and you don't say anything it's sir madam ma'am right in english is like that okay in english iba señor joven muchacho but here in spanish is like hey yes i can listen to you ricardo teacher yes lady uh, for the lady, well, that's not very common. You can say, madam, or miss. So it's like, lady. <laughs> it's what we use in Spanish. Ahí se fuera como, bien común como lo usamos en español. Que le decimos, señor. And it would be like, no, right? In English, we don't use it. In English, it is no saying, It is saying lady, niña. Uh, no, you say miss. Miss, for, for a girl, you say, you just use girl. Para una niña le diríamos solo girl. Chica, Pero como no chica. es, ajá. Hey, girl. It's like, hola, chica, hola, niña. Hey, girl. Like, hey, boy. Si es un niño chiquito o un joven. Hey, boy. Hey, girl. Okay. That is the way to approach it. Yes? Uh, can you repeat that, please, me? Okay, miss, missus, this one, missus, this is for single, okay, si la chica está soltera, le podemos decir miss, y el apellido, right, si está casada, le decimos missus, right, missus, like this, missus, and for the boys, mister, mister, okay, and here we have some examples, to so say miss Ito, Mrs. Morgan, Mrs. Chin, and Mr. Garcia, right? We have some examples there. So, in my case, I will be Mrs. Monterosa, right? Mrs. Flores, because that's my married last name, okay? Si está casada, obviamente la chica tendría que ocupar su apellido de casada, right? Mrs. Flores, okay? Es el de. Señora de. Flores, right? So that's that's the use that you give to this one. This is just a little tip that we have about the names. Okay. I have a little friend here. Aquí les presento un amigo que yo sé que lo conocen y lo recuerdan. The alphabet. Aha. I am going to take it out. Who can give me the alphabet without A. reading? Sin leer, a, vamos a ver. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. A, Ajá. A, a, G. G. Nos quedamos en la A. <risa> ah, no, no, es A. G. Ajá. Who can help me? Who can help me? Give me the alphabet without reading, sin leer. Vamos a ver quién me lo puede decir. J, J. Ajá. No, L from the beginning, F desde el principio. Vamos. B, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, A, J. Ay. <laughs> Another one. Vamos a ver, vamos a ver. No. Stephanie, go ahead. B, B, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, O, 
M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y C. Very good, very good. Yay! Un aplauso para Stephanie. Very good. Okay. The alphabet. You might say like, that's very easy. That's for the little kids. The English is very important. The English alphabet pronunciation is very important. Si pronunciamos el alfabeto correctamente, vamos a pronunciar la mayoría de palabras correctamente. Because you need to practice the sounds, okay? We are going to practice the sounds of the alphabet. And please, it is important that you don't eat the letters. No se coman las letras, okay? That's the most important part, okay? Yo sé que ya vamos a ir a cenar, pero no se coman las letras. Please. <laughs> oh, no sé si ya cenaron todos. Okay, so here. Remember, if you want to remember the alphabet, we need to divide it into different parts. For example, here. Okay. I am going to silence you because I am going to explain. So I have A, B, C, D, E, F, G, right? Acuérdense la cancioncita. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. And you stop. And then you have H, I, J, K. Okay, aquí el error de la canción era que todos salían L, M, N, O, P. Okay, no, it's L, M, N, O, P, right? Then you have Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z, right? Let's practice each of the sounds. Here you have A. 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 Hey. 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 Dime tu nombre. D. 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 I. Este es el sonido que nosotros tenemos en español. I. I. Pero no es E, es I. I. The next one that we have F. 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 Y va, va a liberar el aire con su diente y say F. 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 Solo el aire, F. no saliva, el aire. F. 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 G. 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 H. 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 Ok, ahí tenemos que tener mucho cuidado no decir Ash. It's H. 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 I. I. Okay. L. 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 N. M. 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 N. O. 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 The next one. P. 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 Y justo sienten como como una explosióncita del sonido. Dice P. P. This one is Q. 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 This one is 
¿A quién le hablo? A ti. Ti. You. You. Aquí hacemos este, hacemos esta posición con su boca. O sea, B. 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 X. Y. X. Y. Y. Como por qué. Z. No, como la vibración de la Z. 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 Okay. ¿Por dónde nos conectamos? En Zoom. 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 It's the el zoológico, right? Zoo. El animalito rayado, blanco con negro. Zebra. 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 Ok, el que tiene el pantalón o la blusa o el, o el, o el vestido, zipper. 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 Ok, we need to be very careful with this specific sound. Por aquí les dejo un, un truco <ríe> de para recordarlo. Dice: Say A, B. C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, K, L, M, N, O, O, R, R, S, T, U, B, W, X, X, Y, Y, Z, Z, W, Y, Z. Ah, that's easy, right? Ahí sí salió facilito. These are the difficult sounds, right? Esos son como los sonidos más complicados. You say B and B. Say B and B. B and B. Ajá. The next one. B. This one. La primera es B con los dos labios. You say B. B. Y la otra es la dental. You say B. 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 And B. This one is C. C. D. T. D. T. A I A I A I Q K Q K Q K M N N M N N M What about this one? E E A E I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I You say P U ano P P P P P P P P P P P P P P P P P T D P T D P T D That's good. <laughs> Pero lo recordamos, right? PTV. S. 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 S.
A A A I I O O U O O A A E I O U A E I O O Very good Ok, let me see. We're going to practice. We're going to practice. Ahí vamos. Tienen que ser buzos. A cualquiera le puede tocar. <laughs> ok. Nancy Jocelyn. B. 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 Ok. Juan Guzmán. B. B. D, D, T. T, D, T. Laura Díaz. A. 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 I. I. A. I. A. I. Ok, <coughs> aquí no pasó nada. Laura Díaz. A. I. A. I. <laughs> María del Carmen. The next mm. one. Q. K. QK, very good. Jonathan Fernando. Very good. Let's see. Claribel. E I. Very good. Mary. P P D. Very good. Jancy. X C. Very good. N. Paola Cruz. A -I -O -U. Very good, very good job. So, any question, chicos? Algún sonido que se les complique? Which one? Which one? L H. 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 Another one. H. 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 W. 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 Another one. H. X. 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 Right? X. 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 The next one. Another one. G, remember, G, Z, C, Z, 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 R, 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 J, 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 Y, 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 Y. And why? Okay, Once. now I am going to take you back to kindergarten. We're going to take you back to kindergarten. Aquí sin pena, ¿verdad? sin nada. You say A, B, C, D, E, F, G. A, I, I, A, I, go ahead, go ahead. A, okay. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. H, I, J, K. Okay. Aha. So we're going to go here. A B C D E F G. A B C D E F G. H I J K. H I J K. L M N O P. Q R S T U V W. X, Y, Z, Z, Z. Okay, students, to finish the class, to finish, give me words with the letter A. Palabras con la letra A. Give me words with the letter A. 
Airport. Airport. Apple. 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 Allison. April. 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 Angel. Another. Angel. I ah, thank you very much. <laughs> With B. Amazon. B. Amazon. Good. With B. Banana. 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 Bird. Bird. Brother. Board. Board. Beach. Beach. The beach. Good. I watch. They watch. They watch. I watch. Boots. Boots. Give me words with C. Angel. ¿Quién le agarró la cola al perro? With C. Angel. Cook. Cookie. Very good. Classroom. Classroom. Very nice. Give me words with a coffee. Perfect. Okay. Words with F. F. Fire. Fire. Fox. Fox. Fast. Fast. Foul. Foul. Ring. Foul. Foul. Ring. Foul. Ring. Ring. The next one. Yeah. Give me words with fantasy. Right? fantasy. Good. Give me words with H. H. Home. Help. Home. Hell. Very oh. good. Give oh. me words with M. Mom. 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 Miracle. Mom. 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 Mister. Good. Give me words with T. Tortilla, tomato, teacher, table, good, Twitter, Twitter, good. Give me words with W. Waiting, 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 watermelon, good. Okay, give me words with P. Purple. purple potato. Good. Purple and potato. Very good. Plant. You see? Plant. Plant. This is a very good way to practice vocabulary. El que me diga, ay, no puedo practicar vocabulario, no sé cómo. Get one letter and start writing. A lot of words with that letter. Okay. Tomorrow we have a dictation exam. Vamos a hacer un examen dictado mañana. Practice the pronunciation of the letters because you are going to use it. Okay. I am going to dictate 15 words. Le voy a dictar 15 palabras. Letter by letter. So practice okay. spelling. That's going to be tomorrow. Well, my dear students. Yes. Bye. Eh, será que esa me la puede practicar al día después, pues ya que por motivos laborales mañana me voy a no creo que me pueda conectar porque saldré súper tarde del trabajo. Okay. We are going to see. Vamos a esperar. Ojalá pueda salir temprano. Si no, Ricardo lo va a hacer aquí para toda la clase. <laughs> The next day. <laughs> okay. So, my dear students, I am going to see you tomorrow for another class. Have a beautiful night and sleep well. Uy, what happened? <laughs> Have a beautiful night. Bye. 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 Goodbye. Bye. Take care. Sleep well. Que descansen todos.